So this formula for f of n plus a half might look a bit strange to start with. But actually it's useful because if you only want to sum um, a function of just the odd numbers, then you can write the odd numbers, of course, as 2n plus 1, which you can also write as something times n plus a half. So if you only see odd numbers in, in the formula you're trying to evaluate the sum of, then uh, this is actually a, a, quicker, a quicker formula to use. So um, notice there's a plus sign here. Here we've got tan. And of course, um, we can't have any uh, singularities in this, in this expression. So if, if f has any poles, then to ensure that those poles don't uh, appear in this formula, we have this condition here. Okay, so if f has a pole at zj, then um, we don't want n plus a half ever to equal zj.